Hello friends. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start, please like this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And click the bell icon. Thanks. In reaction to the royal pair Prince Harry and Meghan Markle going entirely off the rails with the tell-all memoir, King Charles might depose the couple's royal titles, a royal biographer has claimed. According to royal biographer Tom Bauer, King Charles may strip the Duke and Duchess of Sussex of their titles in what he considers a pretty radical move. King Charles III could strip Meghan Markle and Prince Harry of their royal titles in retaliation for the Duke of Sussex's upcoming book, a royal biographer has claimed. But do you think this is the right move? Vote in our poll. Tom Bauer further asserted that the 416-page book spare, which the author thinks could make or break the Sussexes, might prevent the King Charles from retaining Archie and Lilibet's titles. The potentially incendiary document had been approved for an anticipated autumn publishing date, but it was postponed until January 10 out of respect for the Queen after her passing. Royal family enthusiast Niall Gardner also warned that the couple could lose their titles if the book attacks the firm, telling Express.co.uk. Buckingham Palace will be very concerned by the release of Harry's book. There is a lot of nervousness about it. Harry and Meghan will be cast into wilderness and lose their royal titles if this is an all-out onslaught against the royal family. He also claimed that the impact of Spare's publication could do a great deal of damage to the royal family and have a catastrophic impact on Meghan and Harry's standing. The couple chose to step down from their roles as senior working members of the firm and relocate to the U.S. in 2020. They retained their Duke and Duchess of Sussex titles, given to them by Queen Elizabeth on their wedding day, but lost the right to use their HRA status in an official capacity. Their children, three-year-old Archie and one-year-old Lilibet, are eligible to use the HRA style and titles of Prince and Princess following Charles' accession as the grandchildren of the sovereign but have not been granted this honor. Royal author Katie Nichol claimed that the king may be waiting until after the publication of Harry's book to decide on his grandchildren's titles. She told the Daily Mail's Royal Podcast Palace Confidential earlier this month, it will be very interesting to see what the king does and whether he uses that as a sort of final conciliatory move and bring Harry and Meghan back in. But I think so much of it comes down to a matter of trust, and there is a sense that bond of trust has been broken by the couple. Harry announced his memoir in June 2021 and more details were released last week. The memoir will be available in 16 languages internationally, and Harry will voice the audiobook himself. Harry is reportedly donating proceeds from his book sales to charities close to his heart, Scent Bale, and Wellchild. The book's description reads, for Harry, this is his story at last, with its raw, unflinching honesty. Spare is a landmark publication full of insight, revelation, self-examination, and hard-won wisdom about the eternal power of love over grief. Spare takes readers immediately back to one of the most searing images of the 20th century. Two young boys, two princes, walking behind their mother's coffin, as the world watched in sorrow and horror. As Diana, Princess of Wales, was laid to rest, billions wondered what the princes must be thinking and feeling, and how their lives would play out from that point on. The most recent remarks coincide with other claims that according to an expert, King Charles Ioli does not wish to humiliate Prince Harry by removing him from his royal position of Counselor of State. So what do you think about this news guys? Please, share your personal opinion with us in the comments section below. Thank you.